So if you actually wait long enough, you can actually see Link falling asleep here, which actually is like the cutest and funniest thing ever. Okay, we're gonna save really quick, and it's probably not the best place to start a video, but we're gonna save. Um, I just, I remember, I always forget that you can actually replenish your health there. I'm hoping that this boss won't be too bad. I'm, I'm assuming that it has something to do with using a bow and arrow. Um, I'm excited. I really am excited because I haven't fought a boss in a bit. I think, the, I, I, I forget which last, was the last boss I fought the, the ancient cistern? That might be it, actually. That was a really cool boss. Okay, where is it again? It's up this way, isn't it? The shield, like, I thought I wouldn't, it wouldn't look good, and, like, the thing is, it, it's, it shouldn't matter what looks good or not, but sometimes it just does, especially in Zelda games when you're playing for so long. I think my playtime in this game now is 24 hours, uh, which, I mean, I've taken up a full day of my time with this game, and I don't regret it one bit. We don't need any hearts or anything, so we keep, we, we'll, we'll just keep going, we'll just keep going uh, to, to where we have to go. Is it here? It's down here, I think. Oh, well, this is exciting. It's always exciting. Like, the bosses in this game have been really, truly, actually, like, amazing. Like, I really think they have been. I think they're a lot of fun. They're, again, I, I, I said they reminded me kind of like a mixture of um, the bosses in Majora's Mask and Wind Waker and the Rare game, which, like, is I think is high praise anyway. That's my viewpoint anyway. Um, I would save again, but, like, there's not really much of a point, is there? I guess we have to grab it. The last one we did pretty easily. Not that this one will turn out the same. Oh god, no, not at all. Um. Nope. Nope. Is that it? No, that's not it. Wait, is that it? No, 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 it's not. Um. Okay, <laughs> this is actually... Perfect! Well, not perfect, but it works. That's actually one of my favorite things about this game, is that, like, you know, you can... With these puzzle, these door puzzles, like, you you don't always get everything right, but, like... They're like, oh, yeah, you got, you got it close enough. We respect you. Let's hope it has something to do with the, the, bow, the bow and arrow, because, like, I feel like I need to... What? Oh no, this is like my dream. Okay, um... What the hell is this? Um... Do I just have to keep moving? There's nowhere I can go, I don't think. Well... <gasps> it's on the whole ship. Oh my god, this is the greatest thing ever. This is the coolest thing ever. Oh, can I slash this? Hi, fight. Yeah, fight, this is a really bad time. A port master, judging by their size, these tentacles belong to a monster of considerable size. Yes, they do fly, and it's terrifying. The current situation is difficult to determine with a complete accuracy, but signs indicate that the ship is under attack. If we do nothing, there's an 80% chance the ship will capsize. I recommend facing it back with a sacred arrow, then exiting to further attack. Okay, a sacred arrow? Is that just the arrows that I have? Oh, I have to do like a full shot. Full shot. Okay, so it does have something to do with one hours. Oh, they didn't, they didn't even give me any loot. Oh, this is actually really scary. This is really cool as well. Like, like I, I can't understand the hatred for this game. Like, I really can't. And, like, I know, like, people have their opinions, and that's fine. But, like, to me, this game just exudes awesomeness <laughs> at every turn. Especially this. This is, like, something that, like, I didn't think I would ever see in a Zelda game. And I haven't seen it in a Zelda game. This kind of, like... And like the mini, yeah, the mini games in this. Oh my god, I don't know, man. Ah. The mini games, like the mini games. What the hell is this? Oh god. I, I'm happy. I'm happy to do this. I think this is a lot of fun. It's like krakens don't scare me as much as octopus do. I think it's just because octopus. Are, the, the sound of that terrifies me. Let's not have that. Oh my god, they, they changed. It's damaging the whole ship. A few of my favorite things, I don't know if you guys know, but, um, I probably said it before, but one of my favorite things ever about any video game, or anything in general, is, um, you right, fight? Warning Master. It's behind, behind the door? I sense an evil presence on the other side of that door. There's a 90% chance that it's the primary body of mass, the creature whose tentacles are destroying the ship. I suggest making all necessary preparations before exiting to the outside of the ship. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. Um, yeah, I'm ready. 
I'm ready for now anyway. Well, I was gonna say one of my favorite my two favorite things are like a ship capsizing and having an epic battle. Oh my god, what is this? What oh my This is a hands over head moment. <laughs> this is so good. Abyssal Leviathan Tentalus. Tentalus. Well, this is terrifying. And of course the music is really awesome here as well, like why wouldn't it be? Skyward Sword is for some reason has like the best music in the game. Oh, I, I, I got that, but I guess I didn't. Oh, does, do, I, do I have to do a full like... I'm trying to break free, okay, do I have to do like a full like... Wind up shot? I do, okay. I do have to do a full wind up shot, I think. Oh, that was a miss! Oh my god, I'm doing bad here. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. I, I believe in myself more than you might think. Only wind-up shots work. No, I'm missing like crazy. Oh, that was... Mm. This would be, this would be, this would be bad if I wasn't having so much fun. I got that. Oh my god. Okay, 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 okay. I got I got to be careful. Got that. Okay, okay. Oh, and it, it knocked Oh no, no, don't go into the water like That was me though. Wait, what? Is there something beside me? Got that. Okay, I can hear it. I should probably have both my headphones on for this one, just so I can hear it. What was that? Hello? Is that what I had to do? Of course it was. <sighs> okay, okay, this is really cool. This is really, really cool. I wonder what, like, um, I wonder what, like, possessed him to do this type of stuff, because I had not seen this in, like, Zelda before. Unless it is in Zelda and I'm just being an idiot. Okay, doing better, doing better. Oh, God. Oh, that was right. Did that go through it? Okay. I, I feel like I got both those shots, but maybe it just went right to the side of it, and maybe I'm not seeing very well. I should probably check out, like, if there's some arrows about the place. <laughs> I think- I feel like they- like, they shoot arrows- oh god, is there something beside me? Yeah, there's- there's, there's arrows right here. It's being incredibly fair. Oh, that was- that was a shot right in. Okay, I got it anyway, so I don't, I don't really care. <laughs> oh, I can't go through this way! Oh, are you serious? You're actually joking. This is too cool. I feel like I'm not worthy. <laughs> This might be my favorite boss in the entire game, even though I do incredibly bad at it. I think this is my favorite boss in uh, Zelda. Is that it? Is that all I had to hit? Okay, and it's gonna come up on this side. No, it came up on this side, of course. Oh shit! Oh that- okay, that wasn't in I guess- oh! Oh, come on! 
Don't be mean. That was oh, is that is that not in? See that problem here is I'm getting nervous. I have to stop getting nervous and just go for it. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, they want me to go on top. Gladly. Okay, sorry about that, guys. There, I actually just had to cut out there for a second, but this is... Oh my god, this is actually so good. Oh god, no! No, 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 thank you. No, thanks. No, thanks. Sorry. No. I love how they wait. <laughs> They're like, oh, we'll give you... We'll give you a couple of seconds. Oh, there's... Oh, you... Come on. Come on. Come on. All of ya. All of ya. I'll take on every single one of ya. I actually like the reason why I had to stop is because like I got that I got this notification of a, a of my college email and like I have to check that just in case like there's something like you know maybe coming up that I have to check out and like I just got information that like one of my lectures is cancelled tomorrow uh, which means that I'm just probably gonna play Zelda all day. <laughs> oh god, they're coming back! Oh shit, I gotta be careful with this. That was a little better that time. I think we're doing better this time. Overall. Oh, he moves. He moved. Got him. Got him. Got him. Oh my god. This is, this is like heart. This is like heart, making my heart race. Wait, what the? Did I do it? Okay, that was like a combination to make my heart race and actually making me very interested in this boss battle. Oh my god. Thank you. Thank you, game dev. <laughs> Thank you, whoever made this game. I still think overall, Wind Waker, like, to me anyway, has better dungeons and better boss battles, but this is just crazy. The combination of music and bosses is just insane. What do we get? We get the Sacred Flame? Oh yeah, we have to, like, uh, we're gonna have an improved sword again. I actually have to go and collect a bunch of items anyway in other places um, from area before, so I actually might be really good. So let's collect this uh, piece of heart, or this ha uh, heart container. Heart container, piece of heart, two different things. Yes. Let's Skyward Strike this. I feel like the one thing about this game is like it's long, but it feels like I'm going on this longer journey, which actually feels good. Uh, something that like I can't say about every single Zelda game that I play. Every Zelda game feels like a journey, but this just feels like a really long haul, and I like it. Oh, mm. Hi, Fi. The flames of Nairu have transformed your blade, expanding the fire's power. She can now help you with your- okay. I guess I did- oh, okay, we can do multiple dowsing? That sword looks so good. Everything's just so epic in this game, I don't- I don't get it. 
I'm making a bold statement. That sword looks better than the Master Sword. Master Sword looks great, and I have a bunch of Master Sword related items around my room right now, actually, that I'm playing in. We have the second piece of the Triforce. With your sword enhanced, you can now learn a new melody. I recommend we return to the Isle of Songs. I recommend we do that too, Fi. See, we have similar recommendations. So, I guess trying to describe exactly why I, I really like this so much is like, first of all, like, it's, as I was trying to say, like, one of my favorite things ever is to, like, fight fight, fight a Kraken in a game. I got to do it in Pirates of the Caribbean, the video game, and it was great. Uh, thank you for letting my ship, uh, getting my ship back. It may have been half-wrecked, but my crew and I got it shaped up to almost proper working order in no time. I wish you good luck in finding whomever it is you're looking for. Come visit again. You're welcome anytime. Oh my god, thank you. Wait, can I is there like a- Oh, okay, he brought me here. Very kind. Very, very kind. So now we can go to the sky. So yeah, just explain why I like that so much. First of all, the sword just looks amazing. Like, a white sword? Who wouldn't want that? Like, it looks fucking godlike. And I stop- sorry for swearing so much. Um... Uh, but sometimes it just happens. It's- it's- <laughs> I guess. Um... But there's just something about fighting on a ship is just so good. Like, the only thing that's better than, like, fighting on a ship that's going down, in all honesty, and, like, no one can deny this, and we all know it, the only thing that's better is, um, fight- defending a castle. That's the only thing in a video game that's better. Like, you know, like, return to the keep- like, retreat to the keep? That type of stuff. They did it in Lord of the Rings of Third Age, and that was great. I actually, like, that's where I got stuck, and I always wish that I played more of it, because it was actually one of the most fun games I think I've played on the PlayStation 2. I loved it, because, like, um... You could choose who you were at the start, couldn't you? Or maybe that's a different game I'm thinking of. No, you had, like, it was a turn-based. It was turn-based. It was turn-based, but it was really good. Let's keep going. So these guys haven't hurt me yet. Are they, are they not, are they not gonna hurt me? Do they want to just, like, guide me to the, isle the, the, the island I'm supposed to go to? It, it's probable, right? Like, I'm probably, like, right by saying that. Oh, we've also killed a boss, so it might make sense to actually go back here, eventually. Uh, to go back to Beetle, I should say. To see if he has any more items. Oh, yeah, they, can't, they haven't damaged me, so, like, I'm assuming, like... Here we go. Learning songs in this game is also is also a nice way of doing things. Like I like the songs don't always sound I guess right uh, to me. Oh, he's going back. <laughs> uh, like at first, and then like I have to listen to him like on YouTube later. And I'm like, oh okay. Like without the, like for some reason the harp to me to together with the songs just never sounds as good as I I think. Well, maybe maybe it's just because I only have one headphone ear on. That's probably the case. I don't, by the way, I don't have one headphone here, I have like one half off, so I can still hear the sounds on the other side, but... Um, I can also hear myself. Master Link, I have information, important information, I should say. When you struck the crest with a skyward strike with your sword, a message from the goddess awakened deep within my memory. The goddess intended this message for you. Master, these are her words. He who seeks the sacred flames, listen well, for I am the one guiding you from my place at the edge of time. The last of the sacred flames still eludes you. To obtain it, you must claim another sacred gift. For each trial you overcome, you shall be blessed with another gift. Make use of the power of these gifts, and you will be most certainly you will most certainly find the path to you to the sacred flames. Now I bestow upon to you another melody. Let it serve as a key to unlocking your final trial. It awaits you upon Elden Volcano. I'm oh my god! I'm gonna be doing the final trial. I'm actually bopping to this, like, you know, not bopping in, like, the dance turns way, but this is really good.
Okay, red's a good look for you, Fi. It looks really cool. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna keep. Oh my. Mm. This game knows what it's doing. It knows it's like killing people with like softly with its songs, you know. Like not killing people in a bad way, but like it, it knows it's hitting us right in the heart. Like it knows that I think. <laughs> According to my records, that song you just heard is called Din's <gasps> Din! Use the song, uh, use the song of Mike to locate the last trial. What? So there is a connection. There is a definite connection between the worlds. Like, of course I knew that already, but like... They're saying it right now. I've committed Din power, Din's power to my memory. Now you have the ability to use dowsing to locate the gate to the final trial. I suggest you travel from, to Elder Volcano. So this is the final one, this is the final dungeon before the final dungeon? That we're gonna be doing? I should remember you can douse for hearts. That's like really useful. That is extremely useful and I haven't like taken advantage of it whatsoever. Okay, so before we end this, I think that it might be a good idea to go check out what Beetle, Beetle has in store for us. And also, I want to say this, um, everyone's, everyone's entitled to their opinions, everyone's allowed to say what they want about games. Uh, personally, I think that this is one of the best Zelda games I've ever played, and I think it's actually going to be, who knows, by the end of this, it might be my favourite. Um, maybe, maybe not my favourite, because I still think Wind Waker and Twilight Princess and Breath of the Wild, and Link Between Worlds, and is just like... I don't know, and Majora's Mask side quest is just me. I think they're all, like, great in their own ways, it's hard to compare them. Um, you know, before I played Zelda, there was this thing where it was like, like, everyone's like, man, each game is like a different experience. And I was like, yeah, sure, dude. Like, yeah, fine. Every game's probably the same. Every game's the same in Zelda. Like, you know, every one of them's the same. It's like Pokemon. It's like, every game's the same. And then, like, Zelda fans and Pokemon fans are seeing it from a completely different perspective. And then I played Ocarina of Time, and I'm like, this is really good. Like, it's really good. And, like, I'll be honest, I, I didn't, I wasn't in love with it. I was in love with the story, but I wasn't really in love with the actual game itself. And then, after that... I played Twilight Princess and I was like, okay, this is like completely different from anything I played in Ocarina of Time. I really love this. I actually think this is one of the greatest games I've ever played. Then I played Wind Waker and after Wind Waker, I was like, okay, something's up here. <laughs> like, this is a completely different game again. It's actually really beautiful. And like, again, it, it, it just like surpasses things I've played before. And then I played Link Between Worlds on the 3DS, which someone asked about, which was Geek asked about, which if you don't know Geek, Geek is a cool dude. Um... Been here a while, been here a long while. A long, 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 long while. Like, it's, 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 it's to the point that, like, you know, couldn't imagine the channel without him. Um, but, um, oh, not here, it's, it's another place. Is Beetle even here at the moment? Um, but then, like, you know, then, of course, playing Breath of the Wild, and then playing Majora's Mask, and all of it just, like, being completely different to the last game. Especially Majora's Mask is just, like, completely freaking different, uh, to all the, oh, we should upgrade some stuff. We should upgrade some stuff. Is, Be is Beetle even around here? Is he hanging about the place? Hey Beetle. Hey Beetle, where are ya? Is he hanging? Is he, he might not even be here. If he's not here, it's fine. But yeah, I don't understand the hate for this game. I have had no problem really with the motion control. I think that every error I've had has come from me uh, being a silly, silly goose. Um, I can't see him anywhere unless he's like hovering above some place that I, I just oh there he is is it no that's not him that's a windmill. Um, you you guys can tell me when when he shows up because I'm not quite sure. In here we're actually gonna upgrade some items as well. So tomorrow, by the way, there won't be a Skyward Sword video. It will be a Breath of the Wild video because the Xenoblade Chronicles side quest is coming out, and I thought I would do that for the day. Um, then I'm, then I'll do like two Skyward Sword videos maybe over the weekend if if I if I think that's probably like wait. What is that? What is this? Is this a, that's a small bomb bag. Just slip into your pouch and you can carry five additional bombs. How much is it? Um, not worth it. I, I, I've i never been in a situation where I have needed more bombs. I, re I don't I think I probably have, but like, I think it's been like resolved. What the hell is this? Uh, that's a small seed. Oh, again, I, I've never been in a, a situation. No thanks, dude. Thank you, though. Thank you. I, I haven't been in, I had like I would buy your stuff, but I just haven't been in that situation yet. 
Is it? Oh, okay. Maybe actually, I haven't in this situation. Uh, how much is it? Hundred? Yeah, that's that's fair. That's fair. Let's do it. That's fair. Because like um, I I've gotten to that point there where I was collecting arrows and like I needed more arrows, so that just makes sense. Go with what you need, like in re in actual life. Um, okay, then we'll get this guy to upgrade some of her stuff, and then we'll probably end the video there. Are you guys excited about the Breath of the Wild stuff? Like, I, can't, I hope they keep doing it. I hope they keep bringing out um more like DLC based around other games. I think that'd be really cool. Okay, so let's upgrade this, I guess. No, let's upgrade the bow. Can we upgrade the bow? Oh, we need oh we need more tumbleweed. Okay, we can get that in. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, okay. What is this upgrade to? We can't anyway. We can't anyway, but we can get those tumbleweeds really easily. Um holds ten. Huh. Maybe? Um, you- maybe, I don't know. But, um, uh, people did say to upgrade this, though, so... Um, this will be upgraded. This- to the scatter shot. I was told to do this a long time ago as well. Go for it, my main man. Go for it. This guy dresses well. If you're a carny. You upgraded to the mighty scatter shot. Your scatter, your shots will now pepper a wide range. Hold A to wait. Did I say pepper? It probably wasn't pepper, was it? Um, what does this upgrade to? I can't, I can't do it. But oh, it just increases the speed. That's something I actually might need. A report master. Because of the improvement to your sword, you can now use the dowsing ability to locate treasure. Please use additional entry in your dowsing targets list as your. Okay, yeah, sure. Ooh. Thanks, Fight. Okay, guys, see you very soon. Um, I had a lot of fun with this episode. Uh, possibly maybe too fun. Uh, I think we might go around doing a lot of side quests then for the... We're actually, I think I might actually just do like an additional like eight episodes just doing side quests. Um, just right before the end, like right before the final dungeon. Um, I don't know how you guys feel about, about that, but I feel pretty good about doing that. Uh, have fun, guys. Ha have good times. Uh, have faith. Um, do stuff. Um, play more Zelda. Because that's all I'm doing this year. This is the year of Zelda. I'm calling it on my channel now. That's what's going to be called. The year of Zelda. The year of Zelda.